<laughs> Do you remember are, when no, you all met, like how it all began oh for you? God. Can you go back 30 years in your brain? Well, a lot of people don't know this because they think of boy bands as manufactured and all right. this. Thousands of people tried out. Seven people tried out for New Kids on the Block. These five, mm -hmm. another friend of mine who was in the band for about a month and quit, and Mark, my brother Mark mm -hmm. Wahlberg. So he was trying out. Wait, I have a question. But we knew Whatever each other. What happened to Mark? <laughs> Mark, uh, he, you know, he, I wrote him a rap record. He ran around in his underwear. And then that was it. Yeah. yeah. But we, the four of us were in, have known each other since first grade. So no we were kidding. friends. And when the group, when I met our producer, Maurice Starr, and our manager, Mary Alford, and became the first member with Mark, um, Mark eventually dropped out to go steal cars and do dumb stuff. And, uh, <laughs> but I kept asking if I could bring my friends in, and I kept trying to convince them to do it. And finally, I was really close with Jordan and John's brother, Chris, and I uh -huh. said, hey, you think Jordan will want to be in the group? He said, only if John can be in the group. And then <laughs> Danny found out they were going to be in it. He got jealous, and then, of course, we found Joe, who was the cherry on top, and but really were, brought it all together. you're all talented. Like, what are the chances that... You understand what I'm saying? It's like, it's what are the chances that you're all talented? Yeah, it's pretty crazy. I mean, we, it, the stars have to align. And um, I think a big part of it is coming from a city like Boston. It just gave us that hard work and mentality and a little bit of a chip on our shoulder. And, and, uh, but we're lucky guys, that's for sure.